Hi, this is Renetta Griffin with Iron Disorders Institute and GetYourIronUp.com. I wanted to take a few minutes to talk to you today about your heart. Before I realized that I had iron deficiency anemia, I was having some really crazy heart situations. I vividly remember a little more than a year ago when I was at my lowest and thought I was exhausted, was I sick? I felt run down. Am I just old? I was asking myself all of these questions, trying to figure, figure out what in the world was going on, never associating it with my anemia. But I got up one morning, literally got out of bed, walked through to, to the front door, went up the front steps to get my two boys out of bed for school, and I had to stop and lie down at the top of the stairs. My heart was pounding so heavy in my chest and so rapid, and my breathing was labored, and I was short of breath and, you know, gasping for air, and my heart feels like it's going to beat out of my chest. And I'm like, you know, this is it. I've got to find out what is going on with me. This is not right. So heart palpitations, irregularity, they can mean different things to different people. Maybe it means that your heart is racing very rapidly. Maybe it's beating heavily and you feel like it's almost visible through your chest. Maybe it's a flip-flop feeling or a fluttering like a butterfly. It can be different things, but it all goes back to the, the fact that when you have anemia, you don't have enough oxygen in your blood cells to deliver the oxygen to your organs, the oxygen that your organs need to function properly. And I'm visual, I like everything in a visual, so I think of red blood cells as big fluffy clouds. They're round and, and puffy and full of air. And when you have iron deficiency anemia, your red blood cells look like a shriveled up raisin or a life preserver that the air has been let out of. And if you visualize that, then you can understand why you're feeling the way that you do. So if you're experiencing the symptom, palpitations, shortness of breath, and the other symptoms that we have listed on our website, such as always being cold, uh, never being able to get warm, severe exhaustion, fatigue, just don't have enough energy to get through the day, headaches, dizziness, um, pale skin, all of the symptoms are listed on our website, and I hope you don't find yourself in those symptoms, but if you do, we're here for you, and we're here to give you information and support to help you to get your iron to a healthy level and to stay healthy.